All right. Okay, guys. Um, good afternoon or good evening. I can see some people joining us live. Um, welcome everyone to this. Um, welcome everyone to this day seven. Day seven of the um, AMA Leeway AMA with Silas Umekwe, project founder. All right, guys. Um, like we started talking about earlier on, um, we said I'm going to be, I'm going to be sharing with us some important fact, an important aspect of the AMA, right? We're going to be talking about some other aspects of the AMA, and um, I hope you gain so much value. For those of you that have been following us for the day one, day two, day three, four, five, and six. If you have not been following us, feel free to uh, check out our Facebook handle, our Facebook page rather, and you'll be able to get out some of the informations there. All right, so tonight we are going to be looking at, um, we are going to be looking at the continuation of where we stopped. We be, yesterday we started looking at the white paper, right? We started looking at the white paper and uh, we will continue from where we stopped talked yesterday. We looked at the scope of the problem, the solution, and all of that. Okay, so let's, um, without further ado, let's, let me share my screen right now so we can um, get straight to business. All right, so yesterday we looked at, we started looking at the white paper in detail, right? So we looked at um, the executive summary, I explained the whole idea um, behind it. We looked at the problems that we hope to solve using the Leeway project, right? And um, they, we have about seven problems. And one of them is the poverty index in Africa. Like I said, the Leeway project is a Pan-African project. That means we are aimed and focused on Africa. We hope um, to achieve quite um, a feat in Africa. And one of the major, issues with the poverty index across Africa. So we hope to bring a solution with the Leeway project for that. Also, there is a very um, huge amount of poor financial um, literacy in Africa. So we also hope to bridge that gap and reduce that number. And also we know that a lot of people have challenges building businesses online, building their businesses online. And I'm talking about people that already have existing businesses um, offline and are looking at going online. So we also are creating um, a seamless um, structure such that um, users that have existing businesses online can learn how they can move seamlessly without um, much hazard. Also, there's been an increase in the number of people seeking information on how to make money online. So this is one of the reasons why um, we are, this is one of the problems we hope to solve with the crypto, um, with the Leeway project. Now, also language barrier, language barrier. Like I said, we are translating the crypto, the uh, educational projects into seven different languages. And those languages have been um, selected in such a way that a huge part of Africa will be able to understand this concept in their own language. And we we'll say we are looking at um, Igbo, Yoruba, Hausa, English, French, Swahili, and Arabic. And why did we choose these languages? Um, based on the poverty index, based on the poverty index, Nigeria was um, one of the countries that is most hit. And Nigeria was hit is about um, 90, we have about 98 million people living in poverty in Nigeria, right? So this is one of the reasons why Nigeria is part, Igbo, Yoruba, and Hausa was selected. So Nigeria has about 20% of the entire poverty index of Africa. So it's one of the reasons why we selected those three languages. Then we selected Swahili because of um, Eastern and Southern Africa. Arabic was for Northern Africa and French was for West Africa. All right, so that's, that um, it will help. We are bringing these solutions in native languages such that it's going to be of immense um, help and people would understand this. All right, so also the existing business model of education, online education, is also one that we hope to bring a solution to. And what do I mean by that? According to statistics, only 7% of the 
of people that pay for online courses actually complete it. And we hope to use leeway to solve that problem by making sure we can take, by um, affecting basic, um, basic models that we have incorporated into our educational smart contract to see how we can jack that number up from 7% to about 70 to 80%. Right, so that's the sixth problem, and the seventh problem is the mass adoption of cryptocurrency. Um, without a doubt, one of the major challenges suffered by cryptocurrency adoption is information, lack of awareness, improper information. A lot of people are not fully aware on um, the whole idea or the whole concept of um, cryptocurrency. I've met a lot of people in the space that, I mean, a lot of people have come in and they just buy this coin, buy that coin without knowing exactly why. And they end up um, losing money and they don't know who to blame or they actually look for who to blame rather. So um, these are all the problems that we have found solution in with the Leeway project, right? Okay, so what is the Leeway solution? Um, like I said earlier, like, like I've always told everybody that cares to listen, we have a 10 year roadmap. But for the sake of achieving what we are set to do, we are taking it bit by bit. We are taking it two years, two years, two years as they come. So if you check our website, you'll be able to see a two-year roadmap. And um, as we get into 2022, that's next year, we are going to update the roadmap. So you see that we actually mean what we say. And we are also doing very well to make sure we hit up, we, we, we meet up faster with the timeline, like some of the projects we are scheduled for, that is scheduled for next year, have already started um, development already. So um, better version may be out before the end of the year. So it's part of the things we are looking at. So Leeway Solution is the Leeway Educational Smart Contract, um, the Leeway Token, the Leeway Wallet, and the Leeway Foundation. So these are the aspects of um, the Leeway Solution. Okay. so. Let's look at the leeway contract. Now, the leeway educational smart contract is one that So the leeway educational smart contract, we explained it. Um, we already explained it um, in our previous videos. So if you want to know more about it, please feel free to go to our Facebook page. You'll be able to see the video where we explained about that, right? Okay, so um, going forward, we also discussed the market potential of the leeway edu. Right, I, I like I usually tell everybody before you get invested on the leeway project, please take your time to study the white paper. Take your time to study the white paper because I'm certain when you do that, you will see reasons why mathematically, mathematically, everything we are doing here is based on statistics, right? And speculations, obviously, but we work with more statistics and um, little speculation. So, but mathematically, we can achieve our aim of um, 42 to, in fact, we can achieve our aim of $500 in two years, mathematically. If every other thing goes um, normal, ceteris paribus, every other thing being equal. But like we always say, this is um, pure speculation based on the amount of facts we have presently. So, um, it's... Um, it's, it could change, a lot of things could affect it. So it's not cast on stone, right? So take your time to study it. I discussed about the market potential of the Leeway Edu project. And um, we looked at this also yesterday, um, looked at the Leeway wallet as well, Leeway Foundation. Okay, so um, straight to what we have for today. What do we have for today? In the next five, 10 minutes, I'll be out of your face. We are looking at the Leeway token launch, the Leeway token launch. All right, so um, across all our social media handles and some blogs, we did the official announcement of the ICO, the public sale. That's the official launch of the Leeway token. All that has been happening before now has been the private sale. We are looking at the official launch of the Leeway token, right? So the Leeway token is a BEP20 compatible token with a fixed supply 
of 10 million tokens. We have only 10 million tokens. Only 10 million tokens would ever be produced and they have been produced. And these tokens would be used as both to provide incentives to users on our leeway educational platform and would also be used as fee for wallet transactions in the leeway wallet. Um, snapshots of the leeway wallets would be rolling out very, very soon, right? So the development is, um, is already started. Although we planned development, starting the development by the third quarter of next year, but um, you know, we always like to under promise and over deliver. So the wallet development is already on, is ongoing. So this is the leeway token we did official launch today. Um, a few things you need to know about the leeway token. The token name is leeway token. The token ticker is L-E-W-T, decimals 18. We are built on Binance Smart Chain, Binance Smart Chain. And we have a maximum supply of 10 million tokens and a circulating supply of 4.2 million tokens. And out of these 4.2 million tokens, um, the circulating supply includes the ICO tokens, the private sale tokens, and um, the ICO tokens, the private sale tokens, and the airdrop tokens. That's what make up the circulating supply. Right? So we need to have that understanding. Now, token sale starts 1st of August, Sunday. Sunday and it ends on the 30th of September. So just for 60 days and the token sale is up. Our soft cap is $500,000 and the mark, the hard cap is $2.5 million, right? So the token distribution, now this is where I want to lay some emphasis. And all the things I'm saying here are 100% verifiable. Leeway Edu reward. Like we said, the educational smart contract, we are going to reward um, our users for watching the videos and taking the classes and completing their courses. And we have reserved, we have reserved 3.5 million, 3.5 million um, tokens, 3,500,000 tokens for um, reward. So 3.5 million tokens will be allocated, will be allocated for rewards on the Leeway Edu smart contract platform. And these tokens will be locked for six months. It will be released six months after the launch of the Leeway Edu project. Six months after the launch of the Leeway project. And why we have done that is because we are trying to ensure that we can create enough scarcity and enough demand. So when we are going on any exchange, we are trading at at least $50. So the essence of most of the locks that has been, that's going on is to ensure and maintain a long, a long, um, long time plan for the leeway token and make sure that we are trading at a good price, right? So 33% of the tokens will be sold at different phases of the ICO. What the different phases of the ICO, I'm also going to be explaining that 33% um, of the tokens, 3.3 million tokens will be sold from 1st of August to 30th of September, right? So that's 3.3 million tokens. Founding team would um, be taking, be reserving 12% of the token. That is about 1.2 million tokens. 1.2 million tokens, right? The founding team will be reserving about 1.2 million tokens. And um, founding team will be, and these tokens will be locked, right? Guys, this token will be locked. And why we decided to do this is because the token creation is not, the leeway project. The token was created to facilitate the project. So the founding team locking their token is an evidence that we are not after the tokens. The tokens has been locked, not will be locked. The tokens has been locked for four years, 48 months. Now, on the white paper, we say it to be released 25% every 12 months, but that's not how we locked it. We locked it and it will not be released at all till the four years, the four, the four years is complete. 
And I'll also, if you check on our website, you can see the vesting contract address. The address where we locked all these tokens that I'm saying, you can check it on our website. Um, it's a verifiable smart contract. You can check it, you'll see the release date. You're going to see the quantity of tokens and all of that. So why we are 100% transparent on this because the leeway token is not our project. The leeway token is just to facilitate our project. That's why the leeway token is a utility token. Core investors or private sale. 5% will be allotted to the core investors. And these are people that bought at private sale. Um, the private sale is still on though. It's just, um, if you're interested in it, you message us directly and we'll be able to facilitate that. But on the 31st, the private sale ends. The private sale ends on the 31st because public sale starts on the 1st. All right, so the core investors are the only ones that would have the tokens in their wallet before the public sale. Every other airdrop, um, promotion, the rest, every other person, including the development team, receives their token after public sale. The only set of persons that would have their tokens in their wallet after, before the ICO are those that bought at the private sale, right? Okay, so core investors will receive 5%. Um, these are people that believed in the project from inception and their tokens will be released to them immediately for their faith in the project. Now, Leeway Foundation, like I've explained in our previous video, if you don't know what the Leeway Foundation is about, please do well to watch the previous videos. Now, the Leeway Foundation, 5% of this token will be allotted to the Leeway Foundation to be used for various charitable purposes across Africa. And it's also to help us achieve our aim of reducing poverty or alleviating poverty in Africa by 1%, that's taking 5 million people out of poverty. So 4% will be used for promotion, reserved for promotional purposes. These include bounties, um, ICO referrals, and other marketing campaigns that we are going to do. 5%, 3% will be reserved for the development team. And the development team consists of um, the project developers. These are the guys creating the content, recording the content, because the leeway Edu is an educational, leeway project basically is an educational project. So all the facilitators, those recording the content, creating content, um, delivering the content and all of that, they are the development team and the 3% will be distributed among them. And it will also be released after ICO, right? Okay, so airdrop, the airdrop is also live. 3% is reserved for airdrop to be dropped at different times for immediate release, <coughs> to be distributed 90 days after ICO sale ends. So airdrop distribution, although phase one of the distribution will be happening um, just shortly after we are done with the public sale, right? Okay, so I said I would not, um, I said I was not going to get this video beyond 20 minutes. And I think I'm already running out of time. Okay, so for the token sale, the token sale, let me just briefly talk the token sale that is launching on the 1st of August. Now we have three phases of the token sale. The first phase, phase one, is going to happen for three weeks. From the 1st to the 21st, the token will be selling at 50 cents. We're selling at 50 cents and um, a minimum investment of $100, maximum investment $2,000. And the total tokens to be sold is 1.5 million tokens. And the, the tokens will be released six months after the close of ICO, six months after the close of ICO. Um, second phase is 80 cents. It will be starting on the 22nd of August to the 10th of September. That's about 18 days. That's about 18 days and it's going to sell at 80 cents. Minimum purchase is $100, maximum purchase is $1,500. Then the final phase, now 1 million tokens are going to be sold. Now the lock duration is four months, not three months, guys, four months. The tokens will be locked for four months and released four months after, right? Then um, for the phase three, the final phase, the final phase, the token will be selling at $1.2. Minimum order is $200. Maximum purchase is $1,000. And the tokens will be released the earliest 
one month after the, the ICO is over, right? Okay, so what I want us to understand, the tokens that are left unsold will be used to provide liquidity on a decentralized exchange. The unsold tokens will be used to provide liquidity on a decentralized exchange and also will be used as staking rewards on our Liwe wallets, right? So that's um, for these tokens that are not sold. And also there's something I really need to make sure you understand. Despite the outcome of the leeway token um, sales, right? The leeway project is going to go on with the development. If we hit hard cap or soft cap or we don't, it's our development of the project is not tied to the outcome of the ICO. So I just thought I should make this clear. The outcome of the ICO, however, would help us achieve our goals and aims faster. But irrespective of the outcome of the ICO, we are still committed to building the project. So thank you so much, guys. Um, we'll continue this tomorrow. And by tomorrow, we are going to be looking at the roadmap. And with that, we can continue. So this is the day seven coming to an end. We'll continue with the day eight tomorrow. So guys, the token sale is launching. The ICO public sale is launching on the 1st of August. 2021 right and this is the schedule so for those of you that are interested please feel free the white you can go and do your kyc like i said we are 100 percent compliant with regulations and kyc is very necessary so you can go to the website click on buy tokens and i'm going to be showing us how we'll do that by tomorrow as well so you go there click on buy tokens and fill in the details upload your your valid id card and you'll be able to purchase the tokens on public sale, right? Okay, so thank you very much, guys. For those of you that are interested in the private sale, the private sale still has about three days before we close. At private sale, come and meet me directly. I'll tell you the price is way cheaper, right? Okay, so that's all I have to tell you. Till I come your way tomorrow, thank you very much for connecting.